Here, this train adventure starts off with a two hour and 45 minute late Amtrak. Uh, I was just going to the park this one day just to hang out. And I heard that this thing was almost two hours and 46 minutes late. It had four engines on it. That was in Buda, Texas, by the way. Next up, while going to my grandparents' house, we decide to take a stop by by Hendenheimer. It's like a town kind of south of Temple, Texas, where the train traffic there is pretty major. We decided to give the train about 20 minutes before we head on to my grandparents' house, and when we were about to leave, um, Mr. Intermodel showed up.
Now, this next thing, um, it was uh, pretty rare. Um, so, when we got to my grandparents' house, I decided, yo, why not check Amtrak? I mean, what could be on there? It's probably going to be the same old P-42 blue-gray Same four coaches, same two engines. But, because this time I was in a completely different location. If I wanted a rail fan, I would have to go to Moody. Um, this time, um, so, and the Fort Worth rail cam lets us see what's coming south or north. Um, I checked the Fort Worth rail cam and... Look what I see. <laughs> yes, that's right. Phase 7, 138, leading on the 21 Texas Eagle. So, uh, you know what that means. To Moody we go. Things were pretty dark at the time because it was around 4 hours and 26 minutes late and it was around 9 o'clock. This is in Moody, phase 7, again. McGregor, Texas, Rattler Hill Road, we would once see Phase 7 leading on the 21 Texas Eagle again.